Hey everybody, it's BC here, and welcome to another episode of Planet Nomads. And today is a very special episode. It's uh, an update I've been waiting for for a very long time. Uh, some of you already know about it, and of course you know about it because you see it in the thumbnail. Yes, we have colors in the game. I have been wanting this for so long. That's like episode 30-ish, 35, I want to start seeing colors in the game. And as you can see, we have... Uh, that's actually just a standard white color, but we have 11 new colors we get to play with. Black, gray, green, yellow, sort of a weird pea kind of yellow. Pea as in the vegetable pea, not that kind of pea, yeah. Anyway, but there we go, we have that, and uh, there's a variety of things that we can actually paint with them. Uh, there are a few exceptions. Uh, there was uh, the emergency 3D printer cannot be printed or painted. Uh, the... The, the scanning radar cannot be painted, and there was one other. Which one was it? Oh, I cannot remember. But anyways, I did everything black just so you can sort of see what actually gets painted on things like this is. I believe this was the med bay. I do believe. I have no idea. It's not showing up on me. But as you can see, like just so many different accents, and all you have to do is just push the middle mouse button while you have your tool equipped. It doesn't require any resources to change the color. So we can go ahead and you can just change the color on the fly, you choose your color, and you just use the left mouse button. And as you can see, different details of each part changes. So it's not like they just did a complete cover, a color overlay and just sort of tinted it. They actually went in and actually did some proper textures. So it looks really nice. Uh, opens up a whole new world of possibilities, brings a lot of life and color to the game. And then another thing that I heard them, that Cranballs had mentioned to somebody in the forums that they were going to add it, and they were going to add it in this, this hotfix. Uh, there was actually a few days I wasn't able to load it. There was an issue with uh, air blades and monuments, wherever uh, that thing over there. Is that it? No, oh, that thing over there. Uh, apparently there was an issue with monuments and air blades and painting and whatnot, and... I almost lost all my save files. I couldn't load in. Uh, but, um, I think that's it. But as I was saying, there was another feature that has been added, and it is extended third person view. Like, look at that. Now, let's see where it was before. It was. Before, it was. Somewhere around here was a third person. So now you're going to go all the way back, and then go run over to the, the X-Wing here, if I can find the right key to push. Like, I wasn't able to actually see the entire thing. Where is that? Come on. I want to get in. There we go. Like, wow. I used to be like this close flying it before, and I was like way back here. We might have to go hit up the helicarrier again. But anyways, that's what we have. We have colors. We have so many different fun projects to do and things to do. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do a, I'm gonna do some uh, painting around here. Get some stuff all decorated. I'm gonna do a little bit of a clip job and throw it all together for you at the end, and go from there. Uh, so yeah, uh, enjoy.
And there we have it. This cold, white world of ours has been filled with the life of color. I don't know about you guys, but I'm, I see so many things, so many new things to do with this. Just the fact that we get colors, like got color coding, you got art projects. You know, people might want to start doing pixel art with uh, the armor blocks or or sculptures or scenes or just try to do something really crazy. But anyway, so that's going to be it for this episode. I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave me a like, and I'll see you all next time in the lab. Later.